Frank Lloyd Wright is probably the greatest architect of the 20th century. Um, he was famous in, before World War I and continued on into the 1950s. And he was famous also for designing houses like this called Usonians that were designed to be affordable modern houses that were essentially the precursors to all our mid-century modern designs. Some of the things that Wright was doing, and clearly much ahead of his time, is he was using open space plans, he was using slab floor construction, he was using unique ways to get rid of load-bearing walls. He loved to use cantilevers. Some people use posts and beams, he liked cantilevers. Cantilever is a device that is anchored on one end, much like a diving board, and it has the other end unsupported, so it floats. And it's a wonderful way that Wright covers space without filling in the space that's underneath it. The house is designed with a slab floor construction, and one of the benefits of that is that like a basement floor, it's in contact with the ground, so in the summertime it tends to cool the house. And it drops the temperature near a good five or 10 degrees. What's going on though with these clear stories is they're functioning very much like the stained glass windows that were often called light screens, that bring light design to ventilation into the house with an artistic flair. That lets the hot air that wants to rise on its own go up and escape the roof, bringing more air to be cooled on the floor, and you essentially have an early green technology where he's making use of natural forces. Wright also talks a lot about organic architecture. He wants to make the house part of its natural landscape. So depending on the time of the day, we'll have a projection either on the floor or the walls, and the, the projection will walk the walls or, the, or floors and act as a little animated light show and you really get the impression of how important good design does matter. Pope Leahy House is a magical place that is much grander and more gracious than it should be.